What up guys, um, back with another video. This one was a request. Um, I just wanted to show something really quick before I do. Um, these, these you might wanna grab, because 1500 gems may seem like a lot and you wanna use them for heroes, but if you're free to play, it might be a good idea to grab them because they're not entirely easy to come by. And as you can see, which I'll show you real quick, you need a bunch like right now I need 30 but it's only at level 8 once that hits like I don't know I think it's 10 it like jumps to like you need a hundred so just throwing that out there before we get to the star tech I'm gonna look at my roster real quick because I'm not entirely sure what's on this one but as you can see I got about three at the moment that I'm using in dark ooh five and uh Superman at the moment three but I'm definitely getting Ronan up because he's on my main and I love Ronan um, nature right there off the bat you got swarms and thinker so and I do want to use Groot and uh, Afra so nature's probably gonna be my main focus I don't care about purple and yellow for this so we're gonna go over here to StarTech now, as you can see, six, 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 and seven. Now, each one, of course, is associated to its faction. Nature, you know, over there you got dark. Superman above, tech to the right. Now, if you notice, since I'm gonna do tech first, her number right there, her power number at the moment is 118105. So we're gonna go over here now and we'll do this heart one right here. Boom, 877. Now if I go back to her, now it's 118282. Those stats kick in immediately. So a big confusion I had when I first was doing this was does it kick in right away or does it not work until you link a hero? Well, no, they work right off the bat. Um, so that's that you go around uh best way to do it is just to do one in each category first because you'll save points and you can't link anybody as you'll notice like her i need well besides needing the uh cubes um you need right here it says reaches 100 so this number in the middle this 11 out of 158 or 1158 whatever uh, yeah, that needs to reach 100 before you can link. However, I'm going to warn you of something that I was not aware of when I first started doing it. So, as you notice, like this right here says 100 for Stormwalker. This one says 100. Now, if you go to the ones in the back, they say like a higher number, like 450. 450. Obviously, that's the difference between S and S+, plus, right? But, one thing I wasn't aware of, alright, back, I had to uh, switch accounts for a moment because I can show it better over here. Now, same thing as before, like I just showed a minute ago, I did the uh, Mother of Swarms, I always call her Lady of Swarms. So I did hers because I use her a lot, but remember how Storm only needed 100? Now it needs to be 240. That's a big difference because now I can't get another one for another 140 levels or whatever that is. That was probably bad math. Um, over here I did rock, not knowing that. And had I known that, I would have saved it to do either Ronin or uh, Storm, maybe even Saint. I wouldn't have did rock. Though I do love rock, I wouldn't have did his first. So that's a major thing to know. Now, I did hers. Again, not knowing the same thing, but I figured the only other person I want to do is hers, and probably hers. So that's going to be a while away. Maybe the pirate, since I finally got him, but I don't have much towards him yet. So that's it. As you can see, for each one, I did all the way out. Now, if you start getting God and Universe heroes, you'll notice there's a tab up at the top. 
you click that then there's a god and universe one too none of the heroes are even visible yet so I don't know when that happens but that's worth keeping in mind that those will appear eventually too but I wouldn't really worry about that unless you have a bunch of them that you're using I started doing it because on this roster um, let me go back here quick Poseidon even though she's only excellent has been phenomenal and better than some of my more beefed up ones when it comes to my main squad which I guess it's easiest just to show it this way not you that's that's at the moment's my main squad but sometimes it struggles because I'm not using full faction but if I take her out and I add her in it lowers my power increases that but it makes every single one of those other four a lot stronger which actually increases their survival she's probably gonna die on me but I don't know why I just did that because I can't beat this oh wow I actually beat it ha take that 18 I've been stuck there for I don't know since last night anyway so pretty much covers um star tech if you aren't sure where you get you know these cubes or you're not sure how to get more of these rocks if it's not obvious star explorer you just go around try to beat as many of the maps as you can I can't can I show them yeah I can show the map I'm on the third one at the moment then I'm gonna I have enough to unlock them all but I'm just doing them in order because they eventually in six days according to the top will reset so trying them all out see which one I like best but I think you kind of have to do them in order don't quote me though so that's pretty much it for Star Explorer and Star Tech till next time peace resistant CD player standard hey the truck uh, looks kind of small there Anton this is live I'm on live T trunk's fine as you can see friend it's not small it's a big trunk i'll show you right here well you got a dead hooker in the trunk what